Hey, what's up guys? It's your boy Eli5 back at you guys with another video and just real quick I just wanted to give you guys a quick recap in regards to what has gone been going on in regards to LeBron James's career So LeBron James has been getting doubted a lot a lot a lot and you really have to give credit to where it's due LeBron James has been proving his haters wrong his doubt is wrong Do you guys remember the times where the narrative was that LeBron James couldn't win in the West? He was just winning in the East and now this year he's got out the West and he's ready to face the Miami Heat in the NBA Finals so he's proved all his doubters wrong in that narrative and you really gotta give him credit he really took a bunch of teams to the Finals where that team had really had no business being there like 2007 that Cavs team outside of LeBron James he really didn't have a lot of help and you could say the same thing for 2018 those teams that LeBron James were put on were not good enough to have everybody expect that that Cavs team was gonna make it that far now I know, I know those Cavs team that I'm referring to that LeBron James were put on, they both got swept. The 2007 one got swept by the Spurs, and the 2018 Cavs team got swept by the Golden State Warriors. Which you could argue that the Warriors had a super team, and LeBron James was just literally out there playing ball by himself without not enough help by his side. But you really, you can't discredit LeBron James for getting swept because LeBron James was the sole reason as to why that ca those two Cavs team made it to the finals in the first place. So you really can't criticize LeBron James for being swept if he was the only one basically dominating in order to basically make it that far you you get what I'm saying so I don't know why people doubt LeBron James and like criticize LeBron James in regards to those standpoints because what can LeBron James do the circumstances is all against him like you he can't do anything in order to you know win those finals like if you're versing a San Antonio Spurs teams with a bunch of Hall of Fame players such as Tim Duncan Tony Parker Manu Ginobili and more and you're just out there facing them literally with a bunch of other players that didn't meet expectations in order to make it that far like you can't really do anything and then 2018 same thing like if you're facing Steph Curry Kevin Durant Klay Thompson and so on and you're just literally by yourself literally just will pound your team all the way that far and you're, you're supposed to lose you can't do anything if you have those odds against you when the team that you're versing in the finals are clearly better than you so i really give lebron james credit and the respect that he, he deserves in regards to his career and the events that has gone on today now ever since lebron james and the los angeles lakers beat the nuggets in the in the conference finals in order to get to the finals that marked lebron james 10th time of all of, of his career of making the NBA Finals that's more time that's more finals appearances than 27 NBA teams the only teams that has more finals appearance than LeBron James are the Warriors Celtics and Lakers and if you're a player if you're a single a single player that has more finals appearances than 27 different franchises what does that tell you i mean me personally i feel like michael jordan still has a slight edge over lebron james but if people call lebron to go i wouldn't be mad lebron james is pulling off the inevitable like no ordinary player is gonna pull off the, the events that lebron james is gonna pull off like for christ's sakes lebron james has been literally dominating the 2010s decade he made eight consecutive nba finals and the only reason why he missed the playoffs last year is because of injury problems and now he came back this year with a better team a fully healthy squad and he's right back to the finals so lebron james is really pulling out hall of fame stats gold material stats and you really gotta respect lebron james for real for real now out of all the finals appearances that lebron james has gone to he's ended up with the finals record of three and six so and he's back in the finals today so he could either fix his record to being four and six or it can make it worse in regards to him being three and seven what do you guys think do you guys think lebron james and the lakers are going to be able to beat lebron james's former team in the miami heat that has jimmy butler tyler hero bam out about all dogs do you guys think the lakers are going to be able to beat them or do you guys think the lakers are gonna fall to, to the Miami Heat. Me personally, I feel like the Lakers are gonna be able to beat the Miami Heat in either six or seven games. It could go both ways because the Heat are a very good team. They're very underrated. They've been very underappreciated, underrated the whole season, and they proved everybody wrong too. We now know that the Miami Heat are not gonna go out without a fight. And I really, we really don't know. You you really don't know if Bam out about Jimmy Butler, that dogness in them could really give Anthony Davis and LeBron trouble, but I really don't know. What do you guys think? Who do you guys think is gonna win the finals? LeBron James and the Los Angeles Lakers or Jimmy Butler and the Miami Heat? Let me know in the comment section below. Now, as you guys can see, the Miami Heat did beat the Celtics 
in the conference finals last night I'm recording this video the day after the conference finals ended in regards to the Eastern Conference Finals and the Lakers and the Miami Heat matched up back in the finals well not back in the finals this is I think this is their first time actually matching up in the finals but honestly speaking I was actually looking forward to this series I feel like it would have been interesting to see LeBron James face his old team and and I'm gonna be clear and honest that's really the only big reason as to why I wanted to see this matchup honestly I feel like it, it would be interesting to see LeBron James face off his old former team in a big stage like the NBA Finals now if the Celtics ended up actually getting out the East beating the Miami Heat in the conference finals and seeing the Lakers in the finals I really wouldn't be opposed to seeing a Lakers and Celtics reunion in the finals because as you guys already know the Lakers and Celtics they have a ballistic rivalry in the finals their, their rivalry is so crazy and historic it goes back to the Magic Johnson days and the Larry Bird days so seeing a reunion in the Lakers and Celtics seeing each other in the finals again that would have been a really interesting series to watch in my opinion just in different players as you really know uh, Magic Johnson and Larry Bird they put on a show for us back in the 80s and we could have seen a potential show against LeBron James and Jason Tatum you you never know but I don't want to get too much off topic the main reason why I made this video actually is to honestly give LeBron James credit as to him making the career that he has made in regards to him being in the GOAT conversation for years on years and honestly in my opinion solidifying his second place stat in, in regards to being the best player of all time behind Michael Jordan and he has he still has plenty of time until he, reti until he retires in order for him to be in first place in order to be better than Michael Jordan but at the end of the day it's an opinion thing people could say LeBron James is better than Michael Jordan people could say Michael Jordan is better than LeBron I won't be mad to s I, I really won't be mad if people said Michael Jordan is better or LeBron James is better in my opinion but other than that I really got everything off my chest in regards to what I had in my mind about this video so that will be the end of today's video I'm just really excited to have another finals matchup another interesting finals matchup bubble version against the Lakers and the Miami Heat this finals matchup is going to be very interesting in my opinion and you already know LeBron is going to show out Anthony Davis is going to show and everybody but I really want to give LeBron James props in regards to him solidifying his places and his accolades inside his career man for real for real make sure you guys like this video and subscribe to the channel i will greatly appreciate it i'm out peace